All right, now that now that we've got that sorted out, let's change the video, the graph brightness to its regular mode. Have it appropriately dark and brooding for a Batman game. I'm gonna leave it a little higher than it was, though. There, everything is darkness. Now we've got the correct atmosphere. A lot of fire extinguishers I could destroy just to be a dick. Sharon Jones, oddly specific name for a random corpse thing. Oh, balls. That is the waitress from the opening of the game, I do believe. Well, that's grim. Are you the person all that blood belonged to? She's dead. Yes, you are. Blood loss, well, I imagine, sir. Looks like she was trying to press this. She lost about a three gallons of blood by my estimation, so yeah. Trapped. Must be more complex than a single button. I should reconstruct her last moments. Well, she only lost about three gallons of blood, so yeah, I would assume she is dead. She attempted to press this switch before succumbing to her injuries. She made it that far only to drop dead at the last second. Jeez, how many buttons do you need? Well, one, how many buttons were built into these walls? And B, how many buttons do you need to access your secret base? All right. Wrong. She must have hit them in a specific order. All right, so it's Simon Says. Wrong again. I need to work out the sequence she hit the switches in. You know, I'll figure it out for myself without you piping up every time I get zapped in the nards. Wrong. She must have hit them in a specific order. Yeah, I got it. Oh, it's... Each switch is one thing. I thought that each one in consisted of individual buttons. So no one came along and reset this because she was on the last phase of this switch puzzle. I spy lots of people with unbroken bones. We best fix that. Ooh. Oh, there's lots of dead people, too. There he is. You dare approach Raish al Ghul? Well, yes. back too many times. The Lazarus dream's all that's keeping him alive. Yeah, that's how it works. Rise again. Seethe your blade. There will be no fighting here. But war is coming. Traitors to the League conspire to stop the glorious resurrection of Raish al Ghul. We will see Gotham burn before we let the rebels hurt our master. He's pretty hurt already, I think. Want you gone by morning. The rebels have found another pit, a pure source. A sample of his essence is all he would need. I won't help you right. either. Then you'll face the consequences of war. We know you, detective. You will not let innocents die. Yet you will not kill the demon's head to prevent their deaths. You I was gonna let him die, yeah. Because your precious morality compels you to. Detective. Help me. Fortaria. That is a dick move to bring up her name. I want to... Rats, I can't punch him. Raiders will die. Uh, so off I go to do the bad guy's bidding for him, I guess. And off through all the shit I've already gone through. Ooh. You could restore Rish's health and then hand him over to the proper authorities. You know no prison can hold him, Alfred. Well, how many prisons have tried? I see. Well, sir, 
What are you going to do? Find the other Lazarus pit. Stop it falling into the wrong hands. How many prisons have tried to hold Raish? I mean, how many times has he actually been caught? I'm just saying, don't knock it till you try it. There, finally at the top of this damn elevator shaft. Oh good, you're stopped bleeding. We know Raish chose you as his successor. The rebels were not the first to betray our master. I'm a little curious about like it'd be awesome if there was like a group of assassins that had started like worshipping Batman or something. If another Lazarus pit has been found in Gotham, I need to track it down. Re yep, need the regular Batmobile for this. Alfred, calibrate the Batmobile sensors to search for trace Lazarus particles in the city water supply. It should lead me to the source. Absolutely, sir. Sending you the real-time visual data now. Sorry, just want to zap the, these people into next week. Good old electroshock therapy. Okay, the map is pretty cool. And I don't have to do the annoying scanning mechanic for it. I, I, I'm sorry, Riddler. All I hear is... Yeah! Side effect of driving in the Batmobile. <laughs> I'm a dick. A rap I could use as a rap. Ah, ramps. Thou art my eternal friend. Now that I have been imbued with the ancient wisdom that one can use you as ramps, you have got to be kidding me. It leads to Batman's hideout. Oh, this is a completely something completely different. This is a Riddler thing. Don't remember how you use all the special attacks. Is this what I'm supposed to do? No, that disables the force field. You know what, fuck it, I don't care. I'll come back for you later. Ooh, this is convenient. Don't need the ice grenades or anything. They're just throwing the word Lazarus in front of everything. Collect, proceed into the Lazarus source. There we go. Why is it- why does this mission hate the, um, freeze grenades so much? First- this might be the first time I've actually had to use the line launcher this whole game. And it led to dick. Oh, it led to this. 
Where's the explosive gel? There, the explosive gel. That's the right button, not the left button. And there she blows! And their eye blows! Excuse me. Doesn't really have the ambiance of Mad Hatter's wacky ass storybook. I don't like the look of that ground. I don't want to touch it. Ooh. I'm getting flashbacks to that scene in Metro at the end of Metroid Prime 3 where you're just supposed to like dive down into the pit of no return on the on phase. Is there anything important on my way down? It does not look like it. This must be the Lazarus pit. Certainly much less uh big than I thought it would be. You could have asked nicely, please don't touch that. We guard this site in the name of our new leader. Yeah, who is that, by the way? I'm curious. Attack. Ooh, I found the one-shot kill attack! I remembered what the combo was. You know, I know that they're trainees, but still, I, th I think maybe you would have been a little better off if you gave them swords so they're not stuck doing that shit. See, they wouldn't be doing that Leroy crap and getting instantly taken down if you had given them swords like good um, leaders would have. Lady, give it up. Interrupted my combo, you filthy bitch! Like four fancy sword attacks that just stand back like fail. You were saying? Lady, give it up. My turn. Now get back up and tell me who your leader is. You know, when, whenever you feel like it. Now, if I could avoid being interrupted. Eh, use a little bit more explosive draw while we're at it. Nissa. You, you're talking like I'm supposed to know who that is. Does Rache know his daughter fights for the rebels? The rebels fight for me, and that zombie no longer knows his own name, or the day of the week, or that his other daughter died. I'm sorry about Talia. She was a loyal fool. I am neither. You understand. So long as my father's corpse sits strapped to those tubes, there will be war in Gotham. What do you want, Nyssa? Go back to him. Destroy that foul machine and let the... thing that was once my father finally die. I'm no killer. He's already dead. He has died a thousand times. You cannot Every possibly have a count of exactly a thousand. He came back worse. More hateful. And if it is exactly a thousand, kudos for him. I tremble to imagine what he would have become if this... ...had fallen into his followers' hands. You know, you could have just let me blow it up. The League will be mine. On that note, dynamite isn't that hard to come by. You could have blown it up yourself. The assassins will leave Gotham, never to return. How can I trust you? I swear by the woman we both loved. I swear on my sister's grave. I will win this war, Dark Knight. It's up to you how long it rages for. 
Um, you had a whole lot of dead ninjas at the hospital. I don't really like your chances. Huh. So that's how that feels. So yeah, um, I have never, ever, 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 ever heard of Talia having a sister or Rachel Gould having another sibling. I mean, um, he had another son in Batman the Animated Series. There's an episode that was basically an entire flashback to Jonah Hex. But like, uh, you were, I was just kind of, you were kind of, it gave you the impression that was a throwaway character because I don't think they even gave him a name or at least not one worth remembering, but... I'm tempted to look this up on Wikipedia because I'm like I'm under the impression they just pulled this out of their ass. <laughs> like people pitched a hissy fit about the Arkham Knight not being an original character, so they said they made a new one and said, "Are you happy?" No, I'm not saying this so uh, whatever is a original character. I'm just saying I've never heard of her before. I'm interested if she is a pre-existing character. Ah, dick. Now I smell like poo gas. I'm not gonna switch costumes though, I like this costume too much. Woo! Get a little boost off of whatever this island, whatever this totally not the Statue of Liberty is. And boom! That didn't kill me. I do. And are you prepared to end a life for her, sir? Eh, I'll let the cutscene that inevitably plays when I get down to him figure that out for me. Sir, if you don't mind, I just wanted to suggest that, given Rish's supernatural longevity and his current state of artificially prolonged existence. Not to mention the fact that he has, in essence, already died. A case could be made that, well... Alfred, stop dancing around and just say, kill the asshole! I swore I'd never kill. He's a dangerous, uncompromising zealot, sir. Restored to full strength, there's no telling what he'll do, or who he might hurt. Is preventing some ungodly resurrection truly the same as taking a life? What would you do, Alfred? I don't know, sir, but I'll stand by you, whatever you choose. You don't have to kill him, you just don't have to save him. See? You've made this decision already. I never get tired of seeing that sweet-ass costume in, um... This gorgeous modeling. And I am sounding super gay. But I have a girlfriend, so I know that I am not. I have a girlfriend, and I like her. I, I, I don't think she'd appreciate me talking about her that way. At least not in public. <laughs> I'll focus on... Where the hell did I go? Where did I go when I got down here? Oh, yeah, I... Elevator this away. There's where I went. This damn elevator is becoming the bane of my existence. If I could blow it to kingdom come, I would. Elevator. They shouldn't have a touch. Ha 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 ha! That elevator's dead as shit! Take that, you son of a bitch! Rotten elevator hell! I have issues, don't I? Okay. Man, they've been busy. They somehow managed to flood their entire building. Which I'm gonna call bullshit on. But it would all not only because I have to carefully traverse it now. Okay. Electrified water. Electrified water. Um. Oh. I am so thankful that random use key appeared. You know, the rebels, these people are expecting me. You'd think they would let me in. All right, I remember her. Oh, no, I don't. That's not the chick I ran into from the opening of the game. Who is James Catterson? Must be one of the guys that the Arkham Knight killed at the start of the game. At Axis K. 
Ace Ace Chemical, not Axis. Or was it Axis? I don't remember. Ooh! Uh, I thought that was pancakes. It's just toast. Who gives a rat's ass about toast? Ah, I'm... I'm kind of hesitant, because... I don't know if, like... If there is actually two endings like there is to the Asriel side quest, or not, or what. I was kind of surprised. I thought it was just going to have a cutscene, but it actually makes you choose. I kind of want a kick-ass boss fight, and I, that's like, I kind of want to administer the cure, but I kind of want, want to destroy the machine, because that's what I would do. <laughs> uh, <sighs> damn conscience, I'll administer the cure. I'm not doing this for you. Oh, so yeah, uh, depends on who it's, um, you have to, um. So I'm guessing it's just a, uh, dep um, changes what, um, group of ninjas you have to fight, which one you pick. Yeah, that's you being stopped. <sighs> Why? I told you, I'm no killer. And you think that means there's no blood on your hands? This, uh... Daughter... Traitor... chemicals remaining no not like him you should have let him die race kills for his cause I never will stubborn stupid fool it's why she loved you oh, I kind of liked her now she's dead Well, that's kind of disappointing. I was hoping for a big, epic Ra's al Ghul boss fight. I'll take care of the necessary arrangements, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Sir, if I may, police reports suggest that the rebel faction is abandoning Gotham in droves. Raish, meanwhile, will be recuperating for some time. You averted war. I have now fucked up. <laughs>